Hi everyone. Okay, now we have two working intent in our uh, hotel booking agent. Okay, one is for book hotel and one is for show all booking. Okay, did you notice something wired in show all booking? No? Okay. When I write here show all bookings, it said as you have two order number one is VIP and number two is this this let's say we have 10 orders it will respond with a huge text okay ideally it should say that you have two orders would you like to see that if I say yes it should return with this one if I say no it should stop there okay so how we solve this problem we will solve this problem by follow-up intent right here's a button to add a follow-up intent okay what is the follow-up intent yes now when user will invoke this intent show all booking intent and in a subsequent message user will write yes so this intent will be invoked okay right what we have to do now we have to go here and change this action to count booking right. and handle here duplicate this code and make this one count count right and in count booking we just remove this one yeah. and we can also remove this line and simply write response here okay it will simply simply say you have four orders you have zero orders you have three orders Okay. here is count booking so show all booking now count booking right save it okay. come here and change our and save it okay so what we have done is we convert show all booking to count all booking and add a follow-up intent on that and name it show all booking and inside it we must have to change this with with this one sure show wins. show wins. right okay let's try it but before trying deploy the function to reflect the latest changes okay our function is deployed so test it show all bookings and it's saying that you have two orders okay if i will say yes in subsequent message okay I have missed two things um, the first is here I forget to enable the fulfillment so request is not going to webhook and the second thing which I have forget to do is to change the response of this for the good user experience now I am only returning that you have three orders so how user will know that he have another option to say yes subsequent so I will add would you like to see them okay the user now know that he have option to say yes or no you can 
function to see it in action okay our function is deployed so test this show all booking okay you have two orders would you like to see them I simply say yes okay um, it is now returning with full text we can we can also remove this one this one from this message okay here are your orders right so now it will say that here are your orders number one is this 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 and number two is this 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 all right all right okay what is the other use cases of this follow-up intent um, uh, let's say you're making a bot for ordering pizza for ordering food right um, so when when user uh, is done with placing the order food you may ask user for a sauce or uh, for 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 a um, different appetizer okay um, see you in next video bye bye